the notorious motorcycles. I mean, not motorcycle scooters. Everywhere. Let's see what's going on around me. This is New York City. Whoever is selling scooters and came up so big, they're making so much money, they don't know what to do with it. I want to know what they're going to do with the scooters when the winter time comes because when it's really cold out here, it's not going to be too cool to be riding on the scooters. You'll be sliding all over the place. I'm just giving you that, that raw footage, letting you see everything that's going on out here. We made it, we made it, we here. We're at the most famous, most popular intake center in probably all of America. So let's um, cross the street. Welcome to the Roosevelt Hotel. Let's see what's going on today. You know what we're gonna do, we're gonna walk around the the whole hotel. Let you see what's going on out here. I don't got my friend Diego with me for the smooth, smooth trans um, translation, but I'm out here. More migrants coming in as you can see. Let's walk to the back of the building as well. You Let you see what's going on. We got the U.S. military here. They the one regulating it. You can't ask too many questions down here because people don't really talk with you here. But uh, see some migrants lined up right there. Hold on. Migrants lined up right here. Just coming in right here as well. I got this right here. I guess it's some kind of intake center to help them out. Let's go around the block real quick. We'll come back, check it. I'm walking around the whole building. A lot of stuff going on here. Yeah, they got a lot going on, but as you see, it's still, still some more, uh, migrants coming in so they're coming in every day every day I'm gonna give you all the raw exclusive footage as much as I can show you back of the building and see what's going on. All sorts of different things is going on here for the migrants. The notorious motorcycles. I mean, not motorcycle scooters. Everywhere. Let's see what's going on around me. New York City. Whoever is selling scooters and came up so big, they're making so much money they don't know what to do with it. I want to know what they're going to do with the scooters when the winter time comes because when it's really cold out here, it's not going to be too cool to be riding on the scooters. You'll be sliding all over the place. I'm just giving you that, that raw footage, letting you see everything that's going on. Out here.
give you that authentic feel. A couple weeks ago, it was packed. You couldn't even walk on these uh, sidewalks or anything. But look at this. More scooters. More scooters, more scooters. There you go. Everything that's going on. Don't forget you rocking out with the one and only Philly Dom. I'm just giving you that exclusive, exclusive, exclusive coverage of this. Because this situation ain't going nowhere. No matter how everybody wants to, you know, say their piece and give their piece and everything, this situation ain't going nowhere. It's going to be here for a while until they can get this completely under control. Something happened right here. Let's go around. Let's... But this is ground zero for the migrant situation. More migrants right there. Tomorrow I do some exclusive uh, interviews. I have my boy with me, Diego, and we can talk to them and see what's going on. Some raw, real footage. These are the buses right here that they use to put the migrants on. They have them right here. And this is once they stay here at the intake center, then they end up taking them to a facility somewhere in New York City. Some more migrants are walking right by them right now. So New York is pushed to the end with this issue so in the comment sections let me know how you feel about it what you think and just keep me uh posted on how you feel about the situation and i appreciate all the comments i see the comments i see what people saying i see what people talking about i see everything i see everything i see everything man. The buses I'm talking about, migrants coming in right now. Let me see if I stand here where they give me any trouble. Closing it up, but more migrants are coming in. They're just saying every day somebody's coming into the intake center every day. Every day. And this is not even bad like it was a couple months ago, but I feel it's my duty. Let you guys see what's going on down here and keep covering this story until they can come up with some kind of solutions to fix this problem because it's, uh, it's not looking good for New York City. It's a real struggle right now for New York City. It's a real struggle for them right now. Walking around one more time. Yes, everything. But yeah, every migrant has to come through here first before they, you know, send them somewhere else. So there's always going to be something going on here. coverage of everything that's going on here. And right there. Beautiful New York City right here. Sorry. Okay.
nigga. Make sure you go and look at my videos, share my videos, give my videos a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'm gonna keep coming out with this raw, real footage and let you know what's going on. Day by day, I'll be in different locations. As much as I can, I'll be in different locations. As much as I can to let you see what's going on out here with the uh, migrant situation in New York City. I'm gonna do as much coverage as I can, like I said. So uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel, get a video like. Yeah, you rocking out once again with the one and only Philly Dom. I'm gonna travel YouTube if you check my channels. I've been to countries like Brazil, Haiti, Dominican Republic, El Salvador, Mexico, just to name a few. I actually been to actually some of the countries where the migrants are coming from. So I know that struggle, I know what's going on with them. But I will keep documenting, documenting, documenting for you guys. So basically we just walking around the building because obviously you know they ain't not gonna let me in. So I'm just walking around the building over and over just to see what what footage I can get and everything for you guys. And also, man, don't forget, I have a book. I have books on Amazon. Go to Amazon and check out my books as well so you can learn some stuff about me and what I do. But yeah, I'm a travel vlogger. I'm a travel vlogger. I'm a travel vlogger. about my travels adventures and where I've been and the places I've been and everything. That's the book right there. Philly Dom's Life and Truth. Philly Dom's Life and Truth. I'm here in New York City taking care of family first. My son is going to school here so I'm here in New York for now. Don't know when I'm going to get back on the road but as long as I'm here I'm going to keep documenting everything that's going on in the New York area. They go ahead and name Philly Dom all over the place because I put out a lot of videos. So I'm going to be all over the place putting out these different videos in different places. But right now, I want to focus on this migrant, migrant, migrant situation because it's a, uh, it's a real, real, real hot issue and a lot of people have a lot of different, different opinions on there. So I'm just keeping it real with you guys 100% and letting you know what's going on out here in these real streets. Of Manhattan and we at the Roosevelt Hotel I'll go back again and show you I'll show you the uh, the name so you make sure you know I'm here at the Roosevelt show you right over here. I'm gonna walk right here and show it to you right here. You got the Roosevelt. The Roosevelt Hotel right here. Just to let you see it. Let's see, sometimes they, uh, Give me issues over there again. <laughs> I think you know who I am by now. You know. I you, you are. You, I already saw you. Yeah. I already saw myself in you. Oh, okay. Okay. It was good. All right. I did it classy in a tasteful way. Wasn't nothing bad. It was classy and tasteful. I ain't gonna put nobody out there like that. Yeah. Man, they coming in every day, every day, every day, every day, every day. Wow. Non stop. And they won't let the press like cause I'm part of the press, they won't let us in at all. Damn man, this is like top <laughs> this is like top secret. This is top secret. Hey man, it's like this is top secret. He said he already saw himself on YouTube. But that mean I'm doing my job. I'm doing my job. And these are some more of the uh, motos right here. The scooters. 
is how the migrants get around, man. This is how the migrants is getting around on these scooters. We'll sit here for a minute. Let's see if we can catch. Go to the other uh, side of the building real quick. Well, once again, check out my book on Amazon, Philly Dom's Life and Truth. If you want to go there, all you got to do is go to Amazon, type in Philly Dom. It's a green book. It's my life and truth. I talk about my situation. Uh, I was working um, in Alaska in the seafood industry, and then I became a full-time content creator, travel YouTuber. It's good information, man. It tells everything about me. Everything about me. Everything, everything, everything about me. So get that book. And also, I got a couple other books as well. Like one of the back entrances of the place. Uh, let's walk around one more time. Uh, we'll go this way this time. Mix it up. Mix it up. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm chilling. Got my little YouTube channel. So, you know, they want to see. Yeah, they want to see what's going on. So I'm trying, you know, document it for them. Yeah. everything that's going on got the New York PD right there as well you see them but it's peaceful everything is just laid back everybody's relaxed I don't really see too much drama or anything like that going on out here everybody's just handling their business just trying to survive you know everybody handling the stuff Let's make our way around the block real quick. I was gonna go that way, but something tells me to go this way, so I'm gonna go this way right now. This is Migrant Ground Zero right here. Migrant Ground Zero. Anybody come through New York, gotta come to this building. Got, and even most of them end up staying in the hotel as well. I'm gonna take the time real quick, find somewhere so I can show you my um, show you my book as well. Got to do some self promotion too. Welcome to New York City and welcome to the struggle. This, I think this one over here is the main entrance. I think it is. This is the main entrance. This here. What's up, man? All right, that's it, guys. I think I'm done for the day. Yeah, this thing you see what's going on, catching all the, the vibes and what's everything that's going on out here. I will keep, keep, keep bringing out these videos. I give you daily updates all over the city. 
And once again, don't forget you rocking out with the one and only Philly Dom. And once again, it's the Roosevelt Hotel. It's the intake center for the migrants that are coming to New York City. They have to come here first. They have to come here first. So they got the police on duty as well. Two of them. I didn't even know if two was in the car. But this is it right here. This is it. This is it. I'm here. This is it. So talk to you guys later. See you in more and more videos. Another video will be coming out tomorrow with me and my boy Diego. He speaks fluent Spanish. So we'll see if we can get some interviews. I'll take him around to some different places so you can see what's going on. After that, all is well, all is good. Talk to you guys in the next video. Peace, love, and happiness. See you later.